Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ali, if you're new to my channel, and welcome to Beauty with a Purpose. So today, I am here with the infamous get to know me tag. Maybe you'll learn something new about me, or maybe some of you guys already know all of these things about me. Either way, let's go ahead and get into some of these questions. Okay, so it's going to be a series of 30 questions. If you guys want me to do the extended version, like a part two get to know me, go ahead and thumbs up this video and comment down below. Number one is, where did you grow up? I grew up, I grew up some in Lubbock, Texas, where I currently live, and then I grew up some in San Marcos. My, my mom was kind of back and forth, but from, from, from mostly from what I can remember of my childhood, it's all been here in Lubbock. Okay, where do you currently live in Lubbock, Texas? Who is your first, who is your first best friend? My first best friend ever was this girl named Desiree, and we went to elementary. And we went to elementary school together and then we kind of drifted ways in high school, but we were pretty much friends all the way up from elementary up until high school when we parted ways. How tall are you? I am 5'3". Dogs or cats? Neither. I actually don't like either. The only reason I would ever get a dog is for the boys and Brian. But if I had to choose, it would be a dog. Funniest moment throughout high school. Oh my goodness. Okay, so my friend Bree. My friend Bree can attest to this, so I just got some new Nike Air Maxes and I thought I was the ish. And well, when you go walk outside of our out of our outside of our auditorium at our high school, there was like there was like a series of like three steps, but they're like pretty steep three steps. And like on the side, it wasn't really wet rails. It was kind of like just a curb to keep you from stepping off of the steps. And so I decided to try to walk on that curb. <laughs> Like thinking like, I don't know, I didn't expect the curb to be slippery, but I guess people skateboarded on it. And so like when I went to walk down on that curb, like I like busted my butt, like my fleet flew out from out, out from under me and then boom, like I landed on my back on that curb and I was like, oh my God. And so like me and my friend Bree were laughing so hard. And so I was like, let's go over here where nobody saw me fall. And so like we moved where we were standing because we we're waiting on our ride after school. So we moved where we were standing. And then some girl out of nowhere goes over there and she's like, hey, Allie, I saw you fall over there. And I was like, yeah, thanks. Cause that's exactly why I came over here so you could announce it to everybody. But that hands down has to be the funniest moment for me. What year were you born? 1993, made in the 90s. Um, are you in or have you gone to college? I went to Kaplan College. I'm actually in Ashley a nationally registered certified medical assistant. What is your favorite drink? Uh, sweet tea. If I have to choose anything, it'll have to be sweet tea or homemade lemonade. What is your spirit animal and why? Holy spirit. I don't believe in that whole, that's my spirit animal, this or that. Holy spirit's my spirit animal because without holy spirit, I have no direction. You're wearing perfume, what scent is it? Ooh, Paris Hilton, like the black and pink bottle. That used to be my favorite perfume of all time. Tea or coffee, tea. What are your life goals? Well, I'm married now, I have kids. Um, the next step for me would just be to buy a house. What sports do you play or have you played? I'm very much so a volleyball girl. Um, I pretty much just play around with Brian with basketball and stuff like that, because I'm not good, but volleyball is definitely my cup of tea. Have any books you read changed your life? Yes, Fighting Together by Heather and Cornelius Lindsay. And it's a marriage book and it changed my complete perspective because they wrote it from both of their points of view. So you get both points of views, a man's point of view and a woman's point of view. And I don't think, like, I think that did tremendous, tremendous things for my marriage. And it's, and it's um God based. So what is your favorite movie? ATL. ATL hands it down is my favorite movie. I can quote every single line of that movie. Who are your favorite YouTubers? Heather Lindsay, Katia Lamore in Christ, um, Juicy Jazz, and Kyra Stewart. <coughs> Do you speak any languages and how well? Nope, just English. But I can understand Spanish like nobody's business. I just can't speak it. I don't understand it. Like I don't understand why I'm like that. Are you single or taken? I'm married. Who is your idea? Who is your idea of your dream date? Brian. How long was your longest relationship? Um, consistently, my longest relationship has been 
to Brian consistently. Um, Ethan and Ethan's dad and I were on and off for about four or five years. So Brian and I are coming up on that very fast. It'll be, it's already been three years that since we've been dating. Well, since we started dating three years, married will be three years in October. How would you describe your fashion sense? Do whatever I want. Like I just throw stuff together and I notice the outfits where I throw stuff together randomly are the outfits that get the most compliments. How would, oh, uh, what is your go-to hairstyle? Mom bun all day, every day. How many siblings do you have? I have four sisters and I'm in the middle, smack dab in the middle. What is your go-to fast food order? Taco Bell, anything from Taco Bell, usually chalupas. Do you use PC or Mac? Mac. Your most memorable vacation memory? Disneyland when my mom took me and my sisters. What are your morning and evening routines? Morning and evening routines, seriously. Every morning I wake up, the first things I do, I get up, do my do my mouth care and my, and my skin care, and then I go around the house, open up all the blinds, get the boys up breakfast for them and then i usually don't eat till lunchtime so that's usually my morning routine and then my nighttime routine is dinner clean up after dinner make sure brian has lunch for the next day and then shower and skincare and then bedtime do you have any bad habits um one bad habit that i have is always like one bad habit i have is like when brian and i are talking and we'll be in this middle of a serious conversation like i'll like cut him off because Whatever I'm thinking at the moment, like I know I'll forget. And so I try to say it at that moment and then like it ruins like the whole mood of our serious conversation. Tell us one thing about you that we didn't know. Only because I recently told Brian this, I will tell you guys is that I am actually scared of the dark, like terrified of the dark. <laughs> so yeah, so that is a good, something most people probably didn't know about me is that I'm scared of the dark. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so that was part one. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you want part two or comment down below. And if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I loved getting to share things with you guys. So I love you guys, but always remember that Jesus loves you more. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Mwah.